Good morning, traders. Des here at Grok Trade. It's Monday, August 1st, 2011. And a deal on the debt ceiling and cutting spending has been reached. And with that comes bullish activity in the markets. We have the S&PF 1.2%, the Dow up 1.28%, the NASDAQ up 1.23%. Anytime you get a gap and a pop more than 1%, significant that is big time we had both European and Asian markets respond very well last night to this deal being reached and here we are taking a look at this big gap up what I do like on this is we had a trend line look at that we just gap past it boom this is a bad tick forget that lower shadow so that is gone let me show you something else on momentum or velocity. Lower swing low, lower swing low. Look at that rolling roll right there. Boom. So what we have here is a bottom being put in. You can see the rolling formation when you draw these trend lines. Very powerful. And um, that's where we're at right now. So gang, we do have a gap here. To fill that gap, we need to get down here around uh, 129.56 on the spiders to fill it. And most gaps want to fill. However, this is a continuation gap. You will see it pop and never look back. <laughs> it just keep going on. We don't know what this will do. Just know that you know um, statistics or probabilities are most gaps will fill. And it looks like it has, but that's a, just a bad tick. All right. As far as resistance level, oh, before I go into that, uh, we are doing this Wednesday night a webinar, and that webinar is going to be on trading infrastructure or foundation, and that is um, free. All you have to do is click on calendar and get registered. All right, so here are your resistance areas. Actually, I'm going to move that one up right there. And support areas. Take care and safe trading.